Hello, how are you? A little bit tired. Yeah, it's Friday, right? The, the accumulation of the week. Um, maybe we'll be. Yeah. We accumulate all day. I don't think so because uh, you will you feel well when you know that uh, today is Saturday, right? Uh -huh. and, uh, I know that tomorrow is uh, Saturday, but I need to work too. So <laughs> that is the problem. Uh huh. But as it depends on how much you have worked during the during the week that can make you feel like a little more tired than the, than the usual. Mm -hmm. so, so the only thing that makes me happy is that I remember that I want to receive my English. Excellent, excellent. And you will be resting tomorrow, right? You, you don't work tomorrow, do you? Work? Do you work tomorrow? Yeah. Oh. No vacation. No vacation. I, need, I have only time to, to study and work. <laughs> that is the only thing that I have free time. Yeah. Yeah, because it's 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 kind of tiring, right? To be working even on, on Saturday. Yeah, yeah. And sometimes uh, also Tuesday, no, sorry. Uh, Sunday. Sunday. Sunday Do you work Sunday? Sometimes, sometimes. Not always. No, yeah. Okay. Yeah, because Sunday, well, on Sunday, it's better to rest. To recover energy for the rest of the for the rest of the week, right? But sometimes it is necessary to work and yeah, yeah, that's no that is, that is one of the things that brings me uh, happiness to know that uh, Saturday and Sunday, uh, my the company is paying me uh, maybe the double the. Of my salary and or maybe uh, more than that. Ah, that's sometimes, good. sometimes, because our, our extra hours. Ah, you make extra time. Yeah. That's nice. Aha, uh -huh. at least you say, well, I will yeah. work for, for more, right? That's it. Because it is very difficult when you have to work, and you know that is is the same. It's just one more normal day. Yeah, yeah. That's the thing. That is that is one thing. One good thing about my company. That's nice. That's nice. Vamos a ver. Hey, we are more. We're seven, right? Vamos a ver. Let's let's check. I'm going to call you. Hmm. hmm. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening. How are you? I'm fine, thanks. Excellent. Where did we? 30 today. 30 September the 30th. Hi, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. It's my father's birthday today. September the 30th. 
he would be 80, I guess 83 or 84 years old. September the 30th. Vamos. He's very old, right? Hmm? He's very old, right? He would be. He would be. be. Yeah, he died when he was 80. Oh. Yeah. So he will be 80, 84, I guess. Yes. I'm so sorry. Mm -hmm. 84, but he had the best life, right? And we had the best father. It was great. Yes. Let's see, Adriana Maria here. Adri. Present. Nice. Adriana Sofia. Sophie. Analicia. Anna. Not here. Cruz Antonio. Present, teacher. Nice. David Alexander. Present, teacher. Eddie Jonathan. Eddie Jonathan. Elmer Fabricio. Present teacher. Nice. Elsa Cristina. Present teacher. Great. Felix Enrique. Present teacher. Alex. Nice. Grace Michelle. Grace Grace. No here, Grace. Ivo Marcela. Present. Okay. Jennifer Elizabeth. Jennifer. Jose Alberto. Present teacher. Mm -hmm. Nice. Jose Alfredo. Jose Alfredo. Carla Lorena. Carla. No. Mario. Mario Ernesto. Here. Okay. Nubia Zulema. Nubia Nubia. No here. Rebeca Marcela. Rebeca. No Rebeca. Rosy. Nice. Victor Manuel. Victor. Present. Present teacher. Nice, nice. Claudia Guadalupe. Claudia, Claudia. No. Mauricio Emilio. Mauricio. No. Okay. Anybody arrived after I call you? Anybody? No. No? Nobody? Okay. Well, uh, remember yesterday we were talking about a uh, marketing vocabulary, right? Do you remember? Yes. Yeah. Yes, teacher. Okay. No, you don't remember. <laughs> okay. Today, uh, we continue talking about marketing, right? And we're going to work with the vocabulary related to, well, marketing and business. And you're going to complete a couple of sentences using that vocabulary. So we're going to have that first as a review, and then we will enter to discuss the questions that we will today's classes okay sharing mm -hmm. okay remember well this is vocabulary that you know because it's related to marketing right and to business you have design discount retail Location, public relations, advertising, 
brand name, personal selling, packaging, payment, plans and credit terms. Uh, these, these, uh, these are the words that we were working with yesterday. Remember when you were matching and you told me that's very easy to teach. Okay, now that you know the definitions, it's your time for you to use the vocabulary to complete the sentences. Mm -hmm. So do you have questions about any of the words that you're going to be using? No. No? Okay, perfect. We're going to go to the rooms. Let's see, how many are we now? Good evening, teacher. Joanna, how are you? Oh, we're 12. Hmm. We're going to make groups of, groups of three. Yeah, we can make four groups. Four groups of three. I'm going to share that. Let me see. I'm going to share the vocabulary in the chat. I'm sorry. What are you going to do with the vocabulary? Mm -hmm. Complete the sentence. Exactly. Exactly. You're going to complete the sentences. That's a review, right? That's a review because uh, we already know. We already know that vocabulary. Okay. But sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, there will be one group of, of four, and the others will be groups of three. There you go, join. Did you see the sentences in the chat? Yes. Yes, yes? Yes, teacher. Perfect. Yes. Perfect. There we go. Then join a group and go check. Go check and complete the sentences together. Mm -hmm. Hmm, what happened to the people of group two? Okay. Hi. Teacher, in, in five minutes, I will start because I have a problem in my house and I can res I want to resolve. Okay, it's okay. 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 Have a daily and cruise, Claudia. Hello. Hello. Hi, teacher. Hi. In this moment. Okay. Hi. 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 Victor. Hello. Can you show the screen to, to see the, the image? Is a I no. I am I am connected from my cell phone. Oh, okay. So I don't give me a second. I don't give me a second. I'm gonna share. Yeah. Okay. 
please, please. Thank you. I am trying to log in with my computer. Don't worry. Me yeah. too. Um, if I am into in this moment, uh, I'm going up here in the Mian room. Can you well, share? Okay. The first one uh, that say, I don't remember the space, Falco the or Falco, uh, talks about the priming. The priming. Yeah. The second one that say, advertising creates the interest and the desire that space clinches the deal. I think that will wait, be. Wait, 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 please. <laughs> okay. Wait. Okay, I'm gonna. Now see. I see the screen. <laughs> yeah, I see it too. First one, Bramney. Yeah. Bramney. Okay. Second. Advertising you... creates uh, interest. Okay. With dates will be, but um, the second, but that's Bramley. The second one maybe will be a uh, day. Second one. Retail. What is the second? I think that is retail. Okay. That's great. Okay, retail. Maybe. The third one. Third one, it is a uh, plants. I I think it's pavement. Mm. No, because uh, because it say uh, it say what are, what are we metal or plant are okay. uh, payment will be two yeah yeah that will be two mm -hmm. payment payment hi hi hello. Nobody here. Hi, teacher. Hello. Me acabo de conectar, teacher. Yeah, I saw you. But Elmer, I see him here, but. Elmer, hello. Todavía no he terminado de hacer mis cosas aquí. Voy conectando. Teacher, me voy conectando. Eh, ¿Qué vamos a hacer? Es que he tenido unas cosas aquí pendientes. I sent you some sentences in the chat. Those are the ones you're going to complete. Check in the chat of WhatsApp. Yes, I'm doing. Yes, teacher, in this moment. Okay. Okay. For the sign. 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 Okay. Or something the sentences on the right one was on the left. I was the container from the Falco Balco. What mean Falco or Balco teacher? 
I'm going to send you a dictionary. Name of the company? Mm. You know, my favorite dictionary is Cambridge, right? So I'm going to send you the link of the Cambridge dictionary for you to check. Mm -hmm. Ajá, ajá. You can do it together, right? So you help each other. Okay, teacher. In the number one, I see the word is brand name. Mm -hmm. Brand name, brand name, brand name, definitely. Number two. Brand name. How do you say clinches? I le mandé un dictionary. Ah, okay. Check it. Hoy los voy a ir tirando al agua. Okay. ¿A dónde está el diccionario, teacher? In the in the chat, the key. The, I will put it in the. Ah, uh, in the in Zoom. Yeah, in Zoom, but I'm going to put it in mm -hmm. WhatsApp too, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, 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 okay. Uh -huh, I put it in the in the two. Mm -hmm. Okay. 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 No. ¿Por qué? Hasta, hasta el domingo tal vez. No me voy a no, hablar. Make, make, oh, make. Mm, to make draws when, for example, for example, touch big one. Thank 
Number twelve, I think, can be the sign teacher. Mm -hmm. okay. The company is moving factory back to different. Number the last one. The mm -hmm. company is moving its factory to a different. So different. Design or no? No, no, it's not design. Oh. Right. Well, what sentences? Oh. Hmm? What did you say? What sentences? The company is different. He different. Said. different planes. Yes. Mm -hmm. Location then is and what does it say in the last one? <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay, <laughs> it's like Chinese, Korean, like that. <laughs> Ya avanzaron, dijo la chicha. Yeah, wow. <laughs> Maybe in, in the second one can be public public relations. Advertising creation. I don't know. I don't know too. <laughs> Oh. Um, hmm. Estamos mal. No, 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 no. We are, we are okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm just reading. Um, advertising okay. <coughs> creates the interest. Before. Here. I pasted a dictionary in the chat. In the two chats, just in case you found a word that sounds kind of strange, you can give a check. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Okay. I think in the number in the number nine is advertising. With proper advertising, this product will soon be a success. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. It can be. It can be great. I got it. <laughs> I agree with you. Yes. Yes. <laughs> advertising. Oh, advertising. Mm -hmm. Nice. <laughs> no, me quedo bien. Sorry. <laughs> <sighs> It's not you, it's the computer. <laughs> we don't have four and five. Number four and number five. Mm -hmm. Number four, number five, number eight. Eight and number two. Number two. Advertising creates eight, the interest. Eight in can five, be personal five. selling. I don't know. What number? Number eight. The personal selling of this company never solved any problem. Yes. Mm -hmm. Can be. Market target research. Number four, maybe can be design. Number four. Market design must be activated. Mm. 
market size. What's B? Mm, market. You don't have, we only have design. Market plans. And plans. Yes, we don't have just the, the design and plans. Market plans must be activated after the proper market target research. I think. Mm, it can be better. Then. Teacher, help. Us, please. <laughs> 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 I'm only say, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. If, if it's good, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> it's bad. Uh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> okay, repeat, please, Jose. Number four uh -huh. is plants. Plants. The teacher says, mm -hmm. <laughs> No, no, you're not. <laughs> number four. Uh huh. Hmm. Could be, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but yes, very, very close. Yeah, no, of course. <laughs> <laughs> very close. <laughs> okay. Market plans must be activated after. <laughs> target research hmm, yes because it's the only one that we have alone no. uh, packaging and number seven Advertising. Advertising, ya lo ocupamos. Mm -hmm. Solo nos queda. Packaging. No, packaging, no. packaging, and, and public relation, relation. So advertising <coughs> the interest <coughs> and the desire, but public relationship, public relation, this mm -hmm. is the deal. Mm. Can be. <laughs> Mm. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> what is the meaning of the word clinches? Mm. Clinches. Uh -huh. The red. No. Mm. What did you say, Adriana Maria? Cerrar? No. I don't know. Did you check it in the dictionary? The same. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> As Google, <laughs> and Google says that it's like cierra el trato, clinch the deal. Mm -hmm. Public Other relations. It's the interest and the desire, but. Mm -hmm. Maybe it's personal selling? No. Can be. Me. I was thinking about that one. Mm -hmm. yeah. And what will you put in number eight then? Uh, personal selling. Number eight. Mm -hmm. You will have to the, from there. Public relations. 
the public relation of this company never solves any problem. <laughs> Mm, maybe mm -hmm. we can change. <laughs> uh huh. See. Sí. Okay, number two is personal selling. Uh, I... And number eight is public relations. Okay. One minute. Oh my gosh. <laughs> <laughs> One minute. Ah. Okay, six seconds. Nice, everybody here. A ver, what's the first one? I don't remember that. Team Marie, the doping way. Brand name. Brand name. <laughs> the brand name, okay. I don't remember. I don't remember the brand name. Okay, vaya pues. The brand name number here. Okay. Watch out. I don't remember the brand name, Falco, or I don't remember the brand name. That was like, I don't remember the, I don't remember the brand name, Falco or Balco, right? Number two, advertising creates the interest and the desire that... Public relation? Hmm. Public relations. Do they more personal selling. I will say more personal selling. Because mm. the people of public relations are just public relations. They don't sell anything, right? The one that we'll see uh, if they close the selling are the, the people who, who sell. So depending on the ability that they have. There are people who just get close to you and they saw you didn't want to buy, right? So I will go more for personal, personal selling. Yeah, okay. And what methods of are going, are you? Aquí le falta un you. Payment. Are they? Payment. Okay. Payment. Method of payment. Mm -hmm. Payment. Tell me examples of methods of payment. With a credit card. Uh huh. Cash. Cash. Yes. Body. Net fifty. <laughs> With a check, right? A check. Other term, teacher. Other term are, for example. 50% and 15%. Wait, 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 wait. A ver, what were you saying? <laughs> uh -huh. Tell me. When I sell, uh, for example, sell uh, mm -hmm. uh, one product, I give the 
and finish the product, uh, the client pay the another 50%, 15 and 15. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay. But that will be uh, what? Like a promotion? Yes? It's like, yeah, it's like, it's a, like a credit. A credit. Credit? It's like a credit. For example, if you if you have a term, a pay term, net 10, 2%, that's, uh, that means you have to pay into 10 days. But if you pay before 10 days, you have a 2% of discount. Okay, okay. That's. Mm -hmm. So that would be credit, right? Like, uh -huh. yeah. a, a special type of credit. Okay. What about number four? Market. Number four, number four. Market plans. plans. Market. Plans. Market plans. Market plans. Me anda regañando. Zoom. No le gusta que uno copie y pegue. Bye. Uh, market plans must be activated after the proper market target research. Yes? All agree? Yes. Okay. Uh, what about number five? What? Credit terms. Okay. Yes. What credit terms? What credit terms did you and the store agree on? Nice. And number six. Discount. Mm -hmm. He got a 20% of discount of in this. the second book he bought. Aha, uh aha. -huh, uh -huh. Exactly. Of discount in the second book he Boat. And number seven. Design. It has a beautiful design, but the product itself is awful. The designer was good, but the one who did the prototype <laughs> didn't follow the, the, the instructions, right? Okay. Nice. And hmm, that of this company never solves any problems. Public relations. Public relations. Okay. Nice, nice. The public relations of this company never solves any problems. They don't sell and they don't solve problems. Okay. And number nine, with proper, this product will soon be. Advertising. Mm -hmm. Advertising. Okay, with proper advertising. This product will soon be a success. Uh, number 10, this is a small retail. retail store. What is a retail store? A company that is, that sells uh, lower, that has lower sales. Okay. A granel. That's what you call it, right? When the companies sell like small quantities, there are some other companies that sell just three or more or the dozen, right? Or more. 
Okay, this is a small retail store. We can't afford to give though to give you those big discounts. Uh, number 11, what did they choose to sell their product in? Packaging. What? Packaging. What packaging did they choose to sell their products in? Mm -hmm. So I, I wrote in, in the number 11, uh, credit terms. And in the number five, uh, packaging. Mm -hmm. Almost sure. What credit terms did you and the store agree on? What terms did they choose to sell the products in? Mm. It couldn't be credit terms in 11. It would be price if you want to put something like that. What price? Yeah. What price did they agree to choose? Oh, no. What price did they choose to sell their product in? And the in is the one that helps us think about packaging. Mm -hmm. for packaging. Mm -hmm. Okay, and the last one. The company is moving its location. to a different location. Location. Design. <laughs> to a different design. Okay, we go to a different location. Uh, oh, what is my word here? Passion. That's that's it. We did it, right? Any questions? <laughs> no questions. No teacher, no question. Okay. The gas. The gas. <laughs> That's the gas that we need to, to start. Okay. Well, let's move in. We're talking out. We're talking today about pricing, okay? We will come back to this exercise later on. Let's see, prices. What is, why is pricing important? Why or what should you consider when setting the price of the product? We have been talking about that before. Remember, you design the product, you create it, right? You make your prototype. For that, you have to check what are, what are all the materials that you need for your product. You have to take into account a couple of things. Mm -hmm. Who is Enrique Rodriguez? Me. Mimi. Ah, Felix. Ah, Felix. <laughs> as, I, as I always tell you, Felix is saying like, okay. why is yeah, sometimes they, it's so bad, right? Okay, why is pricing important? Volunteers, tell me, why is pricing important? Mm. Me, teacher. Yes, Victor. Okay. Pricing is important when you decide to launch a new product to the market. That is a important factor that you must consider. First, because if you have a price higher than competitors, you you have um menos low possibility to have a success less possibility right less possibility yes mm -hmm. to have success if you have a, a a lower lower price that people think is not is not good exactly that's to cheap. That's 
right? That's yes. just if it's yes. not good. Mm -hmm. yeah. That's it. So that's the reason because you have, you must consider an, how do you say, equilibrium? A balance. Repeat? A balance. A, a balance. balance. Uh, to launch new product is necessary to take a balance between the market price. I was exactly thinking about this word. I don't know how many uh, supermarkets you visit. For example, I visit Super Selectos most of them, right? Walmart. Yeah, okay, Walmart. And I go to, depending, if I want to buy chicken or meat, I go to one super selecto, so to a uh, dispensa I don't want, but I know that some others are not good for meat and not good for the chicken. Because they don't smell good, right? So, um, but going to, to the price, have you noticed that depending on the area where you are, they offer to you more expensive or cheaper products, right? I don't know if it depends on the manager, if it depends on the area, the sales that they are offering to you. And the price says sometimes vary because you have some uh, discounts in some stores that you don't have in others, right? But when you send or you launch a product, you have to think about the market. Who is your target market? Are these people going to buy your product? Is your product of a very good quality that you can say, well, this product I'm selling is much better than the one competition. So I'm going to give it more expensive and I know I can compete because my product is very good, right? But you have to take into consideration the market. Will the people pay for it? Or will they say, no, I already have one that I use and it's cheaper. What do you think? What other aspect? Uh, Victor mentioned market. What should you consider? Uh, what should you consider when setting the price of a product? One, the market. What else? Quality. The quality. Mm -hmm. Brand name. Okay. If something is a recognized brand, people will pay for it, no matter what. Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. What else? What else? Market, quality, brand. Okay. Maybe can be the tendency yeah. in the product um, <laughs> of the moment. Yes, at the moment. Okay, the tendency. For example, right now, you know, a children, teenagers, uh huh. How do you say comodidad? Mm, the comfort. Okay. But check. I am thinking the um, two two important factors mm -hmm. that must be considered. But I am, but I going to mention at the end. Okay. At the end. Okay. Okay. I'm going to let more comment about my classmate. Nice. So we can have tendency of fashion, right? If it is the fashion at the moment, you I I I am thinking about two words too, Victor. Let's see if they the are the place has the, the play, play has a party. Mm, 
we can say that will be in comfort. So that will be part of the comfort in one, that the product can be comfort, comfortable, or if it is like easy to get there and I have a parking lot and I have all the necessary, how can I say, um, facilities in the place, right? That will be part of the comfort. Uh-huh, okay. what else? Teacher, what, what about the raw materials and the, and the uh, I don't know, uh, the cost? Exactly. I was thinking about that, but I didn't want to say it because I was waiting for you, right? Because yeah, me too, teacher. Nice. Hey, you see, I told you. So the cost includes the raw materials. What else? The profit. Taxes. Taxes. The profit, yes. What else? Mm -hmm. What else? What was the question, teacher? The cost. What does the cost include? We what does the cost? The cost include. Ah, include. The raw, mate the raw material, the profit. Okay, the profit is the last thing that we have, right? That, what else? There are two more things. All of all of things indirectly, uh, indirectly uh, you can uh, need for product uh, um, is in a in in a, in the store. Uh -huh, but about the cost. an indirect cost. Uh -huh. The indirect okay. cost, what do we have in the indirect cost? For example, the parking. Mm -hmm. uh, or no, that, that is that, that is a direct. That uh, is for example, the salaries. The electricity, right? electricity. water, the rent. Mm -hmm. If you have a, a loan that you have to pay. Well, the loan will be direct, but the remember you have costs that can be all, all the time, they will be the same, but there are some others that differ, right? Depending on many things. So when you think about the cost of the product, right? For giving a price, how much did you spend in the product? because I have to get a profit, right? I don't want to make the target market go to, a, to buy another product that I don't want to lose money either. Mm -hmm. So I have to think about the materials that I buy, all the raw materials, all the, the people that I have to pay, right? For working, the the warehouse where I'm going to keep the inventory. So all those things are money, right? And all those things have to be considered for the price, before setting the price. Aha, uh -huh. what else? What, what else should we consider when setting the price of a product? Presentation. Okay, that would be like the part of the packing, right? Uh -huh. The presentation of the product, the design, right? In the presentation, we're, the going, to, we're going to. Ah, qué bonita letra. In the presentation, we're going to include the design, the packaging. Have you seen that there are things that are ugly and they are so very expensive? <laughs> promotions yeah. okay the promotions what else someone oh. did mention someone did mention about the profit and that is important 
the percentage that you are looking for to win. Mm -hmm. We were adding the profit to the cost. Uh -huh. So you have all the direct and indirect <clears throat> cost, the raw material, everything, and then uh, that what percentage you want to earn. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But remember, uh, sometimes you, you may want to make a very good profit, but you have to think always think about the market, right? Always think about the market. But something important here also is that if you launch the product at one price, Unless you say precio de introducción and you sell it at one price and then you put the product that you want to get, right? If no, people can get it at the beginning and then say, no, it's too expensive. I don't want it anymore, right? So those are a couple of things to consider here. Okay, nice. Nice, nice. Now, check. There are some marketing strategies that we were mentioning last, last time. Remember, talking about the product, the price, we're here right now, the price and the promotion. And when talking about the price, we talk about the discounts, the allowance. What is allowance? Hmm? For example, if we talk about children, they may receive an allowance when they go to school, right? And they don't work. And you give them like, a, a, by a, these are $10 for the week. That's their allowance. You can, some of them receive it a weekly, others every two weeks or monthly. So that's the allowance. So in a company, you may have allowance that will be like subsiding this price, right? It's like an incentive to increase the sale. Exactly, exactly. Because especially when a product is new, it will need some incentive, right? For people to get to buy it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's, it's like, it's like uh, pay three and take four. Uh -huh. for exactly, exactly. Now check this piece as six. You have the four piece of the marketing mix can be reinterpreted as the four six. They put the customer's interests, the buyer, right? Ahead of the market's interests, the seller. That's what all businesses say, that they are paying attention. Hola, mami, ya voy para la casa. Ahí te escribo, ¿aló? So they always say, okay. Sorry. So they always say, we are putting the customer's interest before the, the, the company's interest, right? And then when we have customer solutions, no products, right? Customers want to buy value or a solution to the problem. And remember what we were saying yesterday, that when we uh, create a product, most of the time that product is to cover a necessity or to give a solution to something. That's why we have so many inventions, right? Because with the new, how can we say? Um, as we are advancing, right? We have new necessities. For example, by coming to the pandemic, there was no much necessity of delivery before, right? People, because if you wanted to buy something, you walk to the store, you went to the supermarket or whatever, and you got your products. But then, with the pandemic, many people were scared of going out 
or they didn't have a car to go or whatever. So they, they didn't want to move to the supermarket. You remember at the beginning, supermarkets were horribly, horribly crowded. So then deliveries started to get more popular and that was giving a solution to the problem that the customers have, right? So customer solutions, not products, right? So I'm giving a solution to you. I'm not giving you a product. Customer cost, not price, right? For, for the customer, we have a cost. Customers want to know the total cost of acquiring or using and disposing of a product. Yeah, uh -huh, but how much will I pay? What will be the total, right? Also, we're talking about the convenience. Hmm, not the place. I don't care about the place. What I need is that it is convenient for me because it is close to me, right? They want products and services to be as convenient to purchase as possible, right? And the places where you, they go shopping need to be convenient too. Communication, and that's why we say C, communication, convenience, cost right cost and the other the only one that goes with another letter is the the s of solutions right communication no promotion for the company promotion is important but for the people for the customer it's the communication customers want two-way communication with the companies right i buy this product uh -huh, but how does it work can you help me install this washing machine that I bought? How can I do this? What is the best use that I can give to this product? So they want this, a two-way communication. Sometimes you, uh, the customers write to the company, but they receive no answer, right? And a customer can escape from a company from buying a product because of this lack of communication yeah but they don't help me when i when i ask them they never answer so uh, i better move to another product where they really listen to me right so this is what customers usually say they don't listen to me so when i ask them or when they when i make an observation or a comment they don't pay attention they don't they don't listen or they don't share, they don't tell me anything. So that is communication. So check what is important for the company. For the company, it is important products, price, place, and promotion. For the people, it is important solutions, cost, convenience, and communication, right? That is uh, the four C's, right? Okay, now let's say these questions. Again, going to talk about prices. Uh, why is pricing so important to market in marketing? You already told me that. And let's see the number three. List five things you need to consider before setting the price. We already mentioned a couple here, right? Ooh, okay, right, all these things to consider before setting the price. Now, is setting the right price easy? Go for number four. Is setting the right price easy? Yes or no? What do you think? Yes? Well, it's no, it's no easy. Mm -hmm. uh, you can uh, put the price, but uh, first, you you need to research uh, all the market, the competitors, and and the preference of the public, and and I know I don't know is 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 more information. Exactly, exactly. So you have to make a research before, right? Before setting the price, because as we were saying, 
or oh, too expensive, nobody will buy it, or too cheap, people will say, mm, it's not good because it's too cheap, right? So <laughs> there are two, the, many things to consider there. Why does the price of gas have a great impact on prices? Have you noticed when the gas, the gas that we use for cooking gets expensive, all the products related to food get expensive. When the gas that we use for our cars, it get expensive, it has a great impact in prices, everything. Even in the things that you say, we don't use gas for that. Why is it expensive? What, what do you think? Why does the price of gas have a great impact on prices? Because it is a, a direct cost mm. for, the, for the product. Yeah. Direct or indirect? Part of the transportation, right? Transportation of the raw material and then transportation of the product that's finished. Okay, let's see number six. Why is it that every time that there is an increment in the minimum wage, prices go up. What's the wage? The salary. If there is an, in, an increment in the minimum wage, so the salario minimo sube, everything goes up. Why? It's about the production and the sales of the uh, if the if, if we can be uh, analyze uh, the price of the product when have a a, a line product or a, a manufacturer and you must uh, change the price change the 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 minimum wage, the cost is 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 um, is increment. Mm -hmm. And that is like a rule, right? That's like a rule. And before I forget, we're going to make a pause and go for the attendance. Okay. <laughs> Okay, let's see Ma Adriana Maria. Adriana Maria. Present, present teacher. Hey, okay, Adriana Sofia. Adriana Sofia. No. Ana. Ana. Cruz Antonio. Present teacher. David. Present teacher. Eddie, Elmer Fabricio. No, present teacher. Okay. Elsa Cristina. Present. Felix. Present teacher. Grace Michelle. Grace, Grace, Grace. Ivo Marcela. Jennifer. Present. Present, Marcela. Ah, Marcela. Ya le voy a poner present a Jennifer. Ok. José Alberto. Jennifer, no, ¿verdad? No sé. Present, teacher. Ok. Jennifer, uy, qué poquitos hay hoy. ¿Por qué? Friday. Ya, yeah, right. Friday, ni la gallina pone. But people say Monday, but Monday you have been resting the previous day. Okay, has Alfredo present. Jose, Al Jose Alfredo? Present teacher. Eh, Carla Lorena? No, Carlita. Mario? Mario? Perdimos a Mari. Nubia Zulema. Present teacher. Rebeca. 
Yo vi a Rebeca por allí. Rebeca. No, mira. Rosa Hilda. Present teacher. Victor. Claudia. Present teacher. Ok. Claudia. No, Claudia. Mauricio Emilio. Mauricio. Claudita de micrófono. <ríe> Se le volvió a arruinar. Me pone en huelga. Es Friday, dice. Ok. Mauricio no aquí, right? Vaya pues. Ok. Let's continue. Let's go. Okay. We are on question number seven. How can the government keep prices low? Is it possible to keep prices low? Yes. How? How can they do that? Mm -hmm. Yes, yes. Reduce the taxes. Okay. Mm -hmm. That would be one way. With the regulation for pricing, for example, the medical product. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Regulating the prices, yes. Because uh, in this moment, the gasoline. The gas. So Biden, right? So citing the, 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 some products. Okay, nice. Now list some prices you consider fair and some you consider unfair. What is fair? Fiera? No. <laughs> fair <laughs> is justo. Ah, y unfair es injusto, right? What prices do you consider fair? And what prices do you consider unfair? Mm -hmm. Chinese products are fair? Almost always. Almost. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, fair when you buy something and it is a, a, a good brand and uh, the use is for many years, for example. <laughs> oh, okay, okay. When you buy a, pro a product that will last for many years, uh -huh, you can say that, mm, that's fair, okay. What about the price of a phone? If, we, if we're talking about the obsolescence, remember we, we were talking last time about the program obsolescence. Do you think the price of a cell phone is fair? That would be unfair. It's unfair. Depend, depend on the brand. Depend on the brand, the size, the features. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, if but, the, but the new models, I think, are unfair because when you just, re, just launch the market, has not stopped the price. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And they get too high, right? They make it yes. too high. Okay. I consider the, the, the price unfair with the cars, for example. They use it. Uh huh, uh huh. Used cars. You're talking about used cars? Yes, the used cars. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm that they have been used for many years and then they are sold very expensive, still like if they were not too old, right? Mm -hmm. 
Okay. Now check. We but have uh, yeah. Teachers, only only I want to comment about this uh, about about fair. Yeah. Um, I understand that fair is when the government uh, take control about the price and is and set a limit for some product. No, but fair is, uh, for example, if you're paying the right price for the right product, as as uh, Elsa Cristina said. Well, if the product is of quality, uh, that I will buy, for example, a buy right that will last for five years i can pay more that would be fair right because it will last many years but if i pay like imagine 50 dollars for a bag that will last only one year hmm, that would be like maybe not fair for example when it's okay. time for going to school you can pay even $72 for a bag. For me, that's unfair. And that's too expensive, right? Mm -hmm. yeah. So yeah. It is more, um, more basically and going on the side of the companies, right? And the quality of the prices that they are offering, especially if they offer to you one product and they offer you quality and the price goes around that, but at the end, the quality is not so good, right? Okay, okay. Then it will be unfair to pay the amount of money that you're paying for that. Okay, Baya, let's go to the conversation check. The comp Petition just released a clone of our headphones. Hi, they are attractive enough to make us lose positioning in the market. What do we do? We could renew the look of our headphones. Let's make them colorful enough so that people can recognize them easily. We can also try with an advertising campaign. Renewing the look and packaging will take months in an advertising campaign is too expensive. The best thing we can do is to change our pricing strategy. It's fast enough to help us counter our competitors' release of their products. Okay, now let's, let's read together. I'm going to be Antonio, you're going to be Rene, okay? The competition just released a clone of our headphones. They are attractive enough to make us lose position in the market. What do we do? We could, we could renew the look of our headphones. Let's make, Let's make them colorful, colorful enough so that, so that people, people can recognize them easily. We can, we can also try, also try with an advertising campaign. campaign. You in the look and packaging will take months. An advertising campaign is too expensive. It's the best the thing, thing we can do is to change our pricing strategy. strategy. It's, it's fast enough to help, help us counter our, our, our competitors. Release of their products. Their products. Okay, I have a question for you. Here, what? going with price uh, with uh, with fair and unfair. What do you think about uh, companies that have a product? In this case, we're talking about a clone, right? So you made your product. Your product is the original, but then the Chinese came and copied your product. And they sold it cheaper. <laughs> Is that fair? Super. No, it's, it's unfair. Okay, it's not. But, but uh -huh. uh, there is, como se dice, intereses oscuros. <laughs> Dark interests. <laughs> Dark interests. Okay, that check. For many people. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Another question. 
Imagine you have the same product. It's not a clone one of the other, but you have your own product. But yeah, let's say in beans, okay? Uh, with the beans, no problem. You go, you plant in El Salvador, all beans are going to be the same, right? Mm -hmm. But what about if I am selling the, the, the pound of beans at 75 cents and then uh, my competitor brings beans from Honduras and he sells them at 60 cents. Is that fair? That competition is fair? What do you think? There is there is supposed to be like a, a kind of agreement between people, right? Or between the, the, the business people that they have to keep the prices like this at a balance, not going too high, not going too, too low, because it is if you go with your price lower you're going to attract all the customers. Because of course, 15 cents less per pound, I will go with the other one, right? So how, how can we deal with that situation of that competition that is not fair? Because five cents of difference can be, I can assume, right? And I can lower those five cents to at 15. My profit will go there. How can you compete in an unfair market? Mm -hmm. Because that happens, right? Mm, I, I don't know, teacher, I, I think uh, in, in this case, uh, the government must or, or should be that sets the rules and the regulations, but mm -hmm. is there is no so no so everybody keeps a balance. Uh huh. Not to it's have the, not to the same opportunity. In the market. Uh huh. Exactly. Exactly. Because if the prices have a big difference, mm -mm. Mm -hmm. it's no competition, right? Mm -hmm. Especially for the national ones, it's, there's no competition. Okay, check this. Um, what would you do in this case? Analyze the situation. The clone headphones probably are cheaper. The others are more expensive. They want to make a change in, in design, but that's too expensive. They want to make an advertising campaign, but oops, it's too expensive too. How can you compete with this product that is an imitation of yours in the market? Would you go for the price, putting the prices down? What would you do in this case of this situation of this conversation? How would you deal with that? I'm sorry, this is a day for making you think more than the usual. <laughs> I'm I'm with the, well, I have been I have been asking why all day today. It's the why day. Uh-huh. So what can you do? Would you lower the prices like they are suggesting? And that's not a, a good idea. Lower the prices is 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 uh engañoso. It's a lie. Mm -hmm. lie. Yeah. Be because uh, many people think when I uh sell my product in a low price, I finish all my inventory. 
but that that is not the 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 same uh, thing in the in the in the customers mm -hmm. and I think we need to focus our our uh, our strategy, marketing strategy. Uh -huh. In in the quality, because so almost almost always when uh, we talk about the clones, is bad quality. Exactly. So sooner or later, people will notice that something is wrong, right, with the product. And okay, yeah, I agree with you. Not taking the price. Would you would you risk with an advertising campaign? It's expensive, but it can bring your customers back. I think it depends what type of of campaign in the advertising do you do you want? Because uh, in this moment, in the social networks, the campaigns is, is very cheap, and you have a, a big market. Exactly. Exactly. Especially talking about headphones, right? If you go to, if you look at teenagers, all teenagers are carrying headphones. We will have a generation, a future generation, deaf. Do you know what is deaf? Sordos. Because they are with the headphones or earphones. At least the headphones are this ones. Right? I don't like them. I prefer to put the audio from the computer directly rather than listening here. It's a good way for, it depends if you cannot concentrate with the surrounding area where this one, right? But if you have no problem with the noise around, it's better they are here and not here. Right, but the earphones are like now a very common part of the of the dress code of the children, right? And teenagers, they are all wearing headphones. So probably sooner or later, they will notice that the clone is not good. And you know that there is always something to identify, so they can to. Uh, they can take that into, into account, right? That the clones are not exactly the same. They have something wrong. For example, in any product, when you see the name of the product is misspelled, that there is one letter that is not good. If it takes double S, the clone is putting only one S. If it with with Z, the clone puts it with S. If it is with Y, the clone puts it with I. So the the customer who is a good customer that has been always using the product will notice that there is a clone that is not the one they like or the the one they usually buy, right? Because the clones don't give the name exactly the same. They can't. They can't. So there is always one letter or one something that makes a difference, right? Okay, let's look at the questions now, check, yeah. They are to make us lose ground. They are what? Mm -hmm. Attractive enough. They are attractive enough. Yes. Let's go for attractive enough. 
to make us lose our copy. What does it make? Uh, what does it mean when they talk about uh, to make us lose ground in the market? What does it mean? Look at the conversation. They are attractive enough to eat us loose. Hmm? Positioning, right? To make us positioning or to make us lose ground. When you are positioned, you are ground. Está bien parado, right? Have you heard that term? Esa compañía está bien parada, right? So they have crown, but if they can make us lose ground or they can make us lose the positioning in the market. Okay, let's see the next one. Let's make them. Let's make them. Mm -hmm. Colorful, Colorful enough. enough. Colorful enough. Aha. Uh -huh. Then let's make them colorful enough. For what? Oh, it's big at the beginning. In a second. Aha, uh -huh. so let's make them colorful enough so that people can recognize them easily, right? And the last one, it's fast enough. Mm -hmm. It's fast enough. <coughs> Thank you. Thank you. Okay. So it's fast <laughs> enough to help us counter our competitors' release of their products. Okay. Questions here? No questions? Mm -hmm. No question, teacher. Perfect. Well. Wow. We're talking about pricing, right? Now let's go to work here, check. You're going to complete the sentences using the words on the top. You have profit, investment, cost, price, taxes, labor, time, transportation, competition, and demand. What you're going to do here is Using vocabulary related to pricing, complete the sentences. I'm going to send you to the groups. Let's see, what time is it? Ah, yeah, we have time. We have enough time. I'm going to stop sharing. I'm going to send you the... the the information in the chat. And then I'm going to send it to the groups for you to work and complete the sentence. That's right. That's shown. Let's see how many we. <laughs> well, let's make groups of three here. Groups of three. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay, perfect. There we go. Try to join. Join the sentences. Join. 
join join Mm-hmm. Sorry, teacher. I can... Are I in the house? Oh, <laughs> but you can. Sorry. Me, me pone también al grupo ahí. Venía en camino por eso, teacher. Me disculpa. Vaya, la voy a mover para que logre meterse, Claudita. Hoy. Gracias, teacher. Okay. Cheque si le aparece. Nice. Mm -hmm. Hi, teacher. Hi, hi. Hi, hi. I'm still trying to compare. Which films of Taylor and the Taylor history? Okay. Number seven. This is transportation. Number seven. <laughs> <laughs> number seven. No. Number seven. Why are you in number seven? No, it is it's the most easy. Uh -huh. No, I'm going to see because in all that I share, we don't stop. Okay. Mm Number seven. It's this price. Are you all, all agree? Yeah, it is price. Is the quantity of money for which one may for which one may buy or sell of a commodity is the quantity of money. The quanti quantity of money or for which one may buy or sell a commodity. 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 Of course, labor. Uh, right. Could be, could be cause, could be cause, maybe. Are going to, mm -hmm. we are going to, we are going to try cause. And I'll, we, I'll check later. Okay, the number four, digamos. Refer to a situation in a market in which firms or sellers independently independently strive for the patronage of buyer in order to achieve a particular business objective. For Investment. example. Yes. Investment. Investment. Okay. Uh, the man. Mm, um, I think the economic principle referee is the price. The well, on the price. Yes, the right. Okay. Of course, no. No price. I think it's, I think price. it's the man because it's 
the consumers desire. It's when uh, consumers want uh, goods and services. It says, I don't know. Okay. I guess it's demand, but I'm not sure. To a consumer. And also it's an economic principle, like offered and demand. Consumers. And maybe um, price, and maybe price can be the second one. Who be the monetary value of goods, of goods and service? Okay, I, you're right. The number, the first is maybe demand. Demand, it could be. Demand. And the second one, price. I don't know what do you think. Price. Mm -hmm. The monetary, the monetary value. Come back. <laughs> the price. Okay. Number three is the quality, the quantity. Oh, is the quantity oh. of money for which one may buy or sell a commodity. Oh. No. Cost. No, one moment, one moment. Number Take two, number, 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 number yeah. three is price. Mm -hmm. Number two, yes. number cost. two is tax. Maybe tax. Mm -hmm. It can yeah. be cost. Mm -hmm. because, because, because taxes is um, like IVA. Because, because it has the monetary value of good and service that producer and customer purchase. You don't purchase a tax. You purchase a product, right? Yes. When, when we import the product, I pay the taxes. Mm -hmm. I think taxes can be the number five. Because they by are mandatory contributions. By... Oh, yes, you're right. Yes. Yes, yes. Maybe number three can be cost. Cost? Because cost. Okay. Because it's a monetary value. Mm -hmm. The customer, okay. Cost. Four. Okay. Four refers to situation in in a market in which firms or sellers independently independently profit sales if you want we can we can continue with number six because it's it's, it's fine i think the the number profit four, if you want you can put it I, i'm not sure i i can understand that uh some vocabulary of the this name Yes, I, I can. Great. I can't understand. I don't know if you if you can. But next, next number six. Yes. <laughs> number six. With the, the, with the last. Okay. Number six. Uh, is the excess of total re re revenue revenue. revenue. Over total cost during a specific period of time. Mm -hmm. okay. Maybe can be profit. Profits. So that's profit. Okay. Profits. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Okay. On the competition.
15 it. You finish, right? Yes. Yes, I finish. Nice, nice. Bueno, let's go. I'm going to check one last group and we go out. Okay. Transportation, please. Transportation, man. Uh huh. Okay. Vamos a ver, es la ocho. Vamos a ver. Is the group of people working in the production of goods and services, bienes y servicios? I think that is the labor. Mm -hmm. The labor. The group of people working in the production of goods of service. Ajá. Uh -huh. And the line is defined as the commitment of current financial resource in order to uh, achieve utilities gains in the future. What? Utilities, no. I... No. We have investment and time. is defined as the commitment of current financial uh, investment. Mm -hmm. oh, let me see, the number 10, this is not only as an accumulation of moments or a benchmark between two or more events in time but a production factor like labor or capital. Mm. <laughs> I think the ten, number 10 is time. I and think nine is investment. A situation Teacher, are you there? <laughs> I think I just because I I I said it's not only as an accumulation of moment uh -huh. or a benchmark between two or more events in time. I think that is time. <coughs> ready, ready? Yes, yeah, ready. Yes. Okay, yes. let's go.
Ready, ready. One minute. Mm -hmm. Okay, a ver, a ver, the first one. Demand. Hmm? Demand. Okay. Demand. It's an economic principle referring to customers' desire to purchase goods and, and services and willingness to pay a price for a specific good or, or service. What about number two, the monetary value of goods and services that producers and customers purchase? Mm -hmm. Price. Are you sure? Or cost. Or cost. I will go more for. Uh, I will go more for cost here. And number three. Price. Yes, exactly. Hmm. Number four. Competition. Refers to a situation in a market in which firms or sellers independently strive for the patronage of buyers. Yes. Competition. Competition. The competition, very good. Now let's go to the next one. Ow. Que mi mouse agarra, quiere él. Number five. Taxes. Tax. What are taxes? Um, mandatory contribution. Mm -hmm. Number five. Yes, mandatory contributions, right? Number six, the excess of total revenue over total cost during a specific profit. Period. Profit. Profit. Okay. In this case, excess no es que hay que gran montón, ¿verdad? But it's like the extra, a part of the costs that you have. That's the profit. Number seven is the movement of goods and persons from places. Transportation. 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 And number eight is the group of people. Labor. 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 Okay, number nine. Okay. Investment. Hmm? Investment. Uh -huh. Financial resources in order to achieve higher gains. Yes. And that is when we have the charts, right? Investment. The charts and the angels ready to invest in your company. Okay. And the last one is not only time. as an account moments, uh, that's the time. Nine.
Okay, perfect. We are very punctual. We finished exactly, right? Teacher. Yes. You put uh, another another page. The uh, anterior a la última que tenía. Let me see. I yeah. This one? Ah. No. This one? Yes, this. Okay. Okay. Great. Thank you. Okay, you're welcome. Now tell me present, present, present. Hmm. Eh, Adriana María. Present. Adriana Sofía. No puedo decir el dato de ahí. Ana. Ana Sofía. Ana. Ve Ana Sofía. Ana, no here. No, 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 no. Cruz Antonio. Present. David. Present teacher. Eddie, Elmer. Elsa Cristina. Present. Felix. I hear. Grace Michelle. He said Grace Michelle por allí. No. No, vale. Ivonne. Ivonne. Jennifer. José Alberto. Present teacher. José Alfredo. Present teacher. Carla Lorena. Carla, Carla, Carla. No, ¿verdad? No, Carla. <coughs> Mario. Here, I'm here. Nubia. Present teacher. Rebecca. Rebecca, no Rebecca. Rosa Hilda. Present teacher. Victor. Present teacher. Claudia. Mauricio. Present teacher. Ok, Claudita. Claudia. Claudia. Ok, no Mauricio, right? Asha. Ok, bye. There we go. See you Monday. Enjoy your weekend. Don't forget. Oh, teacher, thank you. Bye. 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 Good night. Bye. Good night. Bye. Bye. Happy Bye. weekend. Yeah. Good morning. A slip, slip, slip. Bye. Three days. Three days. <laughs> Today I have to. You had to stay. You? Yeah. Okay. You had to stay. Okay, tell me, do you have any questions? Not this right. Bye. Take care. Good night. <laughs> Good night, Movia. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. Tell me, do you have any questions? No, for the class, no. The all of all of them is clear okay. and just I need to review the book and <laughs> <laughs> just just remember the vocabulary and uh, memorize it and that's it <laughs> a lot of new vocabulary yeah so it's yesterday everybody told me ah that's too easy because they were exactly in order but you see today it is, no, it's different. It's a new vocabulary and it's very interesting because it's very, very lady with the company uh, job. And I like uh, the program, but for me, it's the last course Why? because I am very busy and I will return or I will get back uh, 
20, maybe in 2024. <laughs> oh, my God, 2024. Yeah, I I cannot, I cannot able, when I am do, not able to when be do you class. Finish, when do you finish the master degree? Oh. In February 2024. February is my birthday, and February is the last. Uh, maybe I I finish. I will finish in uh, January 2024, and I hope February 2024. Maybe you began this year. Yeah, in March. What is What is it about? It is about the direction, the direction for I mean, uh, direction de empresa, uh, okay. business direction. Wow. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's it's beautiful for me. I I enjoyable. I I like it a lot. Um, but it's it's so many days that they, that I can spend. Uh, studying and studying and studying. Yeah. <laughs> Lots of reading. Lots of reading. Lots of reading. Yeah. They are in many homeworks oh. and tasks, exam. Oh my God. <laughs> but it's beautiful. For me, it's uh, the best. How many subjects are you taking at a time? How many? Subjects. Subjects. Oh. Um, maybe uh, this this uh, this level has nine chapters. Uh -huh. But how many it, subjects? A subject. Oh, subject. Uh, there are twenty or twenty-two in total. Wow, well, yeah. a lot. A lot. A lot. Yeah, because the the subject are 18, 18, 18, but there are four uh, subjects for um, like plan the project, for that way. Uh, like the project that you, you have to do at the end. The project, yeah. Wow. Well, <laughs> but my question is, how many subjects? Because for example, in my master degree, we were taking two subjects at that time. It, oh. it lasts about, okay, it was about two months and a half, three months per every two subjects. But you, how many subjects are you taking at a time? Okay. It is by uh, module. It is depends. It is depends. Semesters. It is the, all of the subjects are online, right? Uh-huh. Um, but the time that is at two years in two years, I have to do all of all of all of the subjects. If I uh, finish before, I can rest. I can take rest. <laughs> uh, yeah, the, it, it, it depends for me if I finish uh, before the time they allow. Uh -huh. Is mm -hmm. it synchronic or asynchronic? Uh, I don't know what it is asynchronic. Asynchronic, what does it mean? Asynchronic is that they upload the material to the platform, you enter in your time to read it. And exactly. synchronic uh, is like we are here now. That oh, okay, no, 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 it's asynchronic, yeah. Asynchronic. Asynchronic, yeah. Uh, well, somehow it is nice because you make your own time. Exactly. Mm -hmm. <laughs> My time for the studying was from nine to one day. That was my night, my time when I when I took the my master's degree. That was from nine nine thirty because I finished in that time. I finished class at nine, so it was from okay nine thirty to one <laughs> to twelve to one to to one thirty. And uh, full time Sunday, so on the Sunday it was directly to that almost the whole day and night until we finished. Exactly. Maybe I I 
sometimes I get up at 5 or 6 p.m. and it is the 9 p.m. and I am from my computer. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I know the feeling. <laughs> oh, thank you. I but, uh, that's, I, I like the program for the, the, these classes. It's very interesting, but I cannot, I, I am not able to be to in the, class. Yeah, to do the things, the two things is, is difficult. Yeah. So sorry. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, yeah, not easy. It's not easy. Being a student is not easy. Yeah, it's and true. It's true. And, true. and at the same time, uh... <laughs> no. <laughs> and every day I like it go to the gym. I enjoy it. when I when it is the moment that that I spend time in my in my gym, and I I like it a lot doing exercising. But oh my. Yeah, I know if you're studying, it's hard to go to the. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So sorry, but I like it, your class. You are very teacher. So I, I didn't know that that you 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 were or you were a great teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Okay, I I enjoy it when the teacher. Eh, Juan Pablo eh, o Juan Antonio? Juan Antonio. Juan Antonio. Juan Antonio. Yeah, but when, when I, I started, maybe he talked to me, talked to me, talked, siempre olvidé la palabra. Yeah, he talked talk to you. Yeah. Talked to me eh, for one month or more, maybe. But uh, I had to tell him Oh, I cannot, <laughs> I cannot uh, receive the two classes because I am very busy. Nice. And and the first and the first subject was uh, I was um um a ver, um temerosa. I was you were scared. Scared. I was scared, and, and I I I told him. Oh, I am not able to <laughs> in class. But in this moment, I tell, I tell me, I I, I said, oh, maybe in this moment I can. Yeah. <laughs> but I can't. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. There is a moment when you say definitely I can't, but then you say like, okay, now I can, right? take advantage of the time when you are able to do it exactly thank you <laughs> continue working continue working. Learn it. that's the best thing do it. <laughs> keep your brain active right exactly excellent well let's go sleep yeah <laughs> let's go have yeah. a nice weekend bye, -bye. enjoy it Thank you. See Take you. Take care. Bye bye. 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 Bye bye. Bye bye. See you.